All right. For our next Santa for Corey's birthday special, we are going to play Double Dare for the NES. All right, what's our team name going to be? I'll just go blues. Why? Because why not? We're taking on Viper team. Our double dare gorilla loves to catch bananas. The first thing to toss the banana into our gorilla's hand and control the questions. Came close maybe a couple of times there. Alright, here's our first question. Why do people send condolence cards? To advertise the condominium to express that people were deaf to announce a party. They're gonna dare me. And I know the correct answer for this. It's to express sympathy over a death. question. Only seen the U.S. that once had a king. I'll say how... Ooh, actually I'll dare them. I honestly don't know. They say Alaska, and that's incorrect. The correct state was Hawaii. Alright, so I was smart to dare them. Linda Hamilton destroyed his Schwarzenegger robot from the future in which film? Beauty and the Beast, Battlestar Galactica, or the Terminator? I think it's the Terminator. Yep, it's the Terminator. What do you call a female gander? A goose. If you live in Washington, D.C., which direction would you drive, it, drive to get to Walt Disney World? We would drive south. Bison was written by which Baron can offer John Steinbeck, William Fuller, or Walt Disney. It's John Steinbeck. And that's a very good book. If you've never read it, then shame on you. Which is the only letter not found in any of the names of the 50 United States. Uh, you maybe? Oh, Q is right. All right. What is a gadfly? Uh, I'll dare. I'll dare them. I don't know. Oh, they're gonna double dare me. Physical challenge. The correct answer? An irritating person.
Welcome to the Double Dare Cake Catch. Your partner is going to launch cakes in the air. You must catch one cake before it's ground about to get on your trampoline. You have 20 seconds to grab one cake. Alright. Couldn't quite do it. So the Viper team gets the money. And they have to control the questions. On board ship, if your captain is on the starboard side, where is it? At the back, on the right side, or on the left side? They're gonna dare. Okay. I'm going to say it's the back. No. Correct answer. The right side. Chain of Sound Lake established a historical area known as Greenfield Village in Dearborn, Michigan. Harry Hyundai? No. Henry Ford, I believe, was the answer. Yep. And that's it for round one. So I have a $20 lead at the moment. <sighs> All right, here we go. Ooh, bowling, okay. One. Oh. All right, that's two. That's that's three. All right. Up to one hundred and ten dollars. Who is the author of Mark Twain's autobiography, Life in the Mississippi? Uh, Clement Moore? No. Mark Twain, of course! Ugh, did not see that. Multiply the number of castaways on Gilligan's Island by the number of Brady Bunch children. How many TV characters do you have? Okay, there were six Brady Bunch children. And I believe four castaways on Gilligan's Island, so 24. Oh, it's not 24. 42, ooh. So there were seven castaways in on Gilligan's Island. So now we're tied up. Mayflower is which state's official flower? Okay. I think it's Massachusetts. We go. Opposite sides of a die will always add up to which number? Uh, yep, seven. One six. Scarface was the name of which of the Chicago Gangster, Al Capone, Clyde Barrow, or Don 
I'm gonna say Capone. Yep, Al Capone. If all were military men, which would rank the highest? Uh, I think Sergeant Slaughter. No. Colonel Sanders. Feline refers to cats. Ovine refers to which animals? They're gonna dare me. I think they refer to sheep? Yes! You're right. It's a rock from outer space. How many cells does the paramecium have? One, one hundred, or an infinite number? I'm gonna, an infinite number? Nope. Just one. Which, in which sequel the movie does bull lightning cause the government robot to go out of control? Short circuit? That's the one. And that's the game. So off we go to the Double Dare Obstacle Course. Never made it all the way to the end of the obstacle course, but let's see if that changes today. All right. one there we go Too much time on that first one, but three prizes, that's not bad. Watch a pool table on a stereo. Plus the $250 from the front game, $600 in cash and prizes. That gets added to Corey's bank for this birthday special. And that's it for Double Dare. We'll see you for the next segment. <laughs> 